Hey yo, what's poppin'? Party people, I'm that one dude Chris from YouTube. Welcome to another three scary games. You know we gotta do one every month. At least one three scary games video every month. And this time I was feeling, I was feeling it. I, I was feeling like, you know, let's do some three scary games. Let's see what they got up. This first game that we have here is called Ritual. Now, it says that it's about eight minutes of gameplay, but hear me out, okay? There are seven, seven <laughs> endings to this game, and we're gonna get them all. You serious? I don't know how they're acquired, but we're gonna get them all. So, without further ado, I'm right into this shit! Tonight is the night. Okay. Uh, I want to believe. Now, I do believe. Oh. oh. Candle? Who is it? I gotta turn my- I gotta turn my headphones up. Look through the people. Oh, it's Shoddy Bay. What's good, girl? What's up? Hey! It's time. Are you gonna let me in? Or what, are you a vampire? Just walk in. Uh, uh come in. Great. Let's get started. Can I interact with stuff in my house first? Wasting up that electric uh, <laughs> electric bill. Herbs. That's a nice, that's a tall ass fridge. What the fuck? Matchbox. Another candle. Turn that radio off. Bag of crystals. Cool. Got it. I think, okay. Theory, right? Before we get into any of the mess, I think that one of the endings is collecting the red candles over the black candles. Because as I've been exploring my house, I've been noticing that there's black candles and red candles. So if it gives me an option, I know that one of those gives me a different ending. What's good with it? There's no time to waste. Is this a good spot? I don't. Do you see anywhere else for us to do a ritual? Uh, it's perfect. Okay, you grab the herbs. I'll get us ready. Herbs. Damn, that was fast! How'd you do that? All right, now we just need the candles. I'm gonna start with, wait, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah, okay. So I think that the black candles give you a different ending and then the red candles will give you a certain ending. That's just my theory right now. But what if you mix them? What if you mix the candles? Bop. Bop. Time to light them. This is gonna be good. I don't think I saw a lighter. Oh, matchbox. Matchbox. Where was the matchbox? There we go. We're ready. Should I have turned the lights off, or should, should the lights have been turned off? Spiritual shade, we summon thee. I, I feel like I'm gonna get possessed here too. I feel like I'm summoning some dark entities just playing this game. We pray to thee. We light the way for thee. Come talk to us. Join and be among us. Among us? I'm sorry, that was such a... Please don't unsubscribe. Who is it? No! Shoddy Bear, are you good? Oh my god! I... I didn't think it would work! It's here! What the fuck did you think was gonna happen? It's real! I'm so sorry! Ah! I'm so sorry. What's here? Oh shit. Uh, so what do we do now? Are we dead? We're dead, aren't we? I'm gonna leave. It won't open. Fuck! Oh yeah, we're screwed. We're done for. We fucked up. It's over. Fire escape. Is that one of the endings? 
Shadow Ritual. Escape the building. Ending seven of seven? Okay. We got one out of seven. <laughs> okay. What if I tell her I'm having second thoughts? As if. Let's get started. Aw, oh, fuck you. I'm gonna try some stuff. I'm I'm gonna try to be experimental. See what I can see what I can cook up. So with all the lights off, let's close the door this time. I'll keep the radio on. Look, no offense, but your flat isn't that big. Don't be a wuss. It'll clean up. I'll it'll clean up. All right, fine. Go grab the herbs. I'll be done here soon. Fine. This is not a very good friend, I might say. Now we just need the candles. All right, let's grab the red ones this time. Spiritual shade, we summon thee, we pray to thee, we let the thee. Come talk to us, come join us among us. Did it work? Let's give it a minute and see what happens. Oh, this is different. Oh. Okay. Okay. What the hell are you screaming at? What are you screaming at? What happened? My eyes! I can't see! Help me! What's going on? What have we done? Come out and play. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that. I don't know if I want to do that. Oh, the fire escape doesn't work this time. No. Okay, well. We got no choice. We got no choice but to come out and play. Uh, uh, blood ritual. Escape the building. Four of seven? Dog. <laughs> so the bag of crystals have to be used for something. Because I forgot I completely forgot about the bag of crystals that were sitting in my room. But what are they used for? How do I get into the other endings? So this time I'm going to mix the candles. I'm gonna do a black or red, black, red, black, red, right? And we'll see what kind of ending that gets us. Hmm. But there's an uneven amount of mm, alright, whatever. So what kind of ending does this get us? I'll do the chance again. Spiritual say, please hear us. We summon thee. We pray to thee. We light the way for thee. Please come and talk to us. Please join and be among us. Ugh, if nothing happens, I'm going to be pissed. Lame. What an anticlimactics. Well, all right. Have a good night. Let's hang around for a bit. See if anything happens. <laughs> okay, you can leave now. You can go. Still nothing. Maybe we did something wrong. The circle was definitely right. The herbs were right, too. The candles, then? Ugh, I don't know. It's late. I better go. We'll try again another time. See you later. Alright, bye. Get the fuck out. You wasted my time. Shoddy. What is that? Shoddy? Jody? Nothing happened. Ending one of seven. Okay. So we got one, four, and seven. Oh, how do you get these other endings? So I'm just going to let it take control of me and see what happens. This is the blood ending, but instead of leaving the building, I want to see what happens if I just let it consume me. That's definitely got to be an ending. Blood ritual. Succumb to the forces unknown. Okay. Okay. So we have one, three, four, and seven. 
We need two, five, and six. All right. Okay. Okay. This should be simple enough. I should be able to do this. I'm thinking that if we, because before when I mixed up the uh, the candles, I tried three red, two black. So I'm thinking if I try three black, two red, and turn off all the lights, maybe that'll do something. But if that doesn't do anything, then I'm gonna turn off all the lights and then do three red, two black again. Hey, how about me and you? We uh we do a ritual of our own in my bedroom, huh? You know what I'm saying? How about you and I do a little? <laughs> okay. Oh, whoa, wait. I didn't even know that there was a grimoire sitting here. <gasps> oh! Oh! What? I think these are supposed to tell me how to get different endings. Because what the hell is this? I know this, we're supposed to take the bag of crystals and then put them on the door. Or the... Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Hold on. Because this one, if we do all the black candles and that demon that's at the door shows up, we put the crystals on the window and the door so that it can't get in. And that's an ending. This one, I don't know what that is. There's a candle. We take the candle and we light something with it. Okay. All right. I got you. We answer the phone. Okay. We need the crystals. Crystals. We need the crystals. Oh, we've already got the crystals. Uh, bop. Uh, bop. Uh, oh, 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 bop. Uh, bop. And, uh, bop. You saved us. I don't believe it. Let's not mess with this any, with this stuff again. Yeah, no, probably shouldn't. I don't. I'm glad we're on the same page here, but definitely not. Definitely not a thing we should be doing. Shadow ritual stopped before it was too late. Okay, so now we need two and six. Oh, oh, six is probably if we uh, if we die to the shadow ritual. So I'm just gonna sit here and let the let the darkness succumb to me. Or succumb to the darkness. Darkness, I call upon thee. I wish to be a shadow person. All right, while I wait for the impending doom. So what is this? Ritual of spirit spilt Iker. The candle goes to something, a lit candle. Was that a broom? Oh shit, oh, okay. It's getting dark. Oh, we're succumbing to the darkness. Okay. Well, they give you quite a while to try and figure out how to get away. So it comes to the forces unknown. Cool. We just need one more ending. One more ending. We got this. This literally could be a video all on its own. Oh my gosh. Let me take a look at this. So we need the five red candles. And then what is this that it's lighting up? Let's just get the candles in position. Now the matchbox has to go to something because you can't light anything up unless you have the matchbox. Oh. Now, girl, these may not be the candles that you wanted me to light, but uh, this is what I call a candle lit ritual. You know what I'm saying? This is a late night candle lit ritual. How about you come meet me? <laughs> I need to stop. There's a broom here. And it says you're supposed to. Do I have a broom? Do I own a broomstick? Where would I acquire said broomstick? Oh no, come out and play. No, I don't think I will. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Snuff the candles. Snuff out the candles. That's got to do something.
That does nothing. Shit, that does nothing. No! No! I was supposed to snuff out the candles! I don't know what that last ending is. I feel I've gotten six out of seven endings on my own, so it's only right that I just, I look up that last ending, right? Can we all, we can come to an agreement here? All right, cool. <laughs> it was so simple. It was, it, it was right there. Oh my goodness. Let me show you what I was missing. It was so simple. So once you get the ritual started and she screams bloody murder, you have to then snuff out the candles and destroy the pentagram yourself. You don't need the broom. You are the broom. Uh... It was so simple. The option to destroy was probably there the whole time and, and I just never noticed it. Stop before it was too late. All right, we got all seven endings. That was Ritual, really good game. I liked the diversity of all the endings. The next game. So this next game, unlike our previous game, only has one ending. And it, it seems a little friendlier than the last one as well. It, it's called Slide in the Woods. What could possibly go wrong with a slide in the woods? What could possibly go wrong with a slide in the woods? <laughs> Boy, I love playing on this slide in the woods. This is the only thing here at the playground. Okay, I'm not gonna question it. I'm just gonna slide down. Whee! Whee! <laughs> that was so fun. Oh, I'm gonna go and do that again. Oh boy. I sure love playing at this singular slide in the woods with no parental supervision. Whee! Oh boy, I'm having so much fun! Oh man, I love when it gets a little deadlier here in the woods. Things start to decay and it starts to get a little darker, but I'm gonna continue to play on the slide. Woo! Oh man. I lost flashlight. Luckily, it still has some battery left. Oh, yeah. I'm still going to play on the slide. There's no reason for me to go home. Because everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be all right. Because I'm just a kid playing in the woods. At least I think I'm a kid. What the fuck is that? Oh, that's a dead bush. I'm just a kid playing in the woods. What did I find? Oh, it's a newspaper. Small town tragedy. Small town in mourning as mass missing persons case at local park continues to go unsolved. Reports say both children and adults missing. A detective working on the case sheds light on its peculiarity, stating it's as if they disappeared into thin air. He asks that if anyone that if anyone has any information pertaining to the case or if anyone spots one of the victims to please contact law enforcement immediately. Oh boy, I sure hope this isn't the slide that they're referring to, because that would be bad. That would be so bad. If I just happened to be at that particular park with that particular incident happening to all these missing persons, please no jump scares. I'm gonna cry if you jump scare me. I'm going to scream at the top of my lungs. Oh. Hey, are you OK? I should probably go home now. This is about the time for me to, like, leave the woods and call 911. Go back to my house and nope, okay. After that, I'm still gonna go take the slide because that's the right thing to do. That is a smart choice. Here we go. We're gonna take the slide. Oh, wow. The slide's a lot longer than it was before. Oh, wow. They must have done some construction midway through my travels into this tunnel of doom. I'm still going down.
Crawl meter. Hold and release. Space wall moving. What the fuck? What the hell is happening? I like this new addition to the park, but I would ask that they don't add the sound effects. It's not supposed to be a, a horror attraction. This is a park for kids, I would assume. Why the hell do I have a crawl meter if I'm not being chased by anything? Oh boy! Oh boy, they really did some addition to the slide here. What the? They did some serious renovating while I was gone. What was I out for about a couple of hours? A couple of days? A couple of seconds? Some fast work for a couple of seconds of work. I'm ascending the stairs to heaven. This is my doom. I'm dead now. Ah! Hi. Bye. I wasn't scared. But am I supposed to go follow that body down the stairs? I think I was supposed to go follow that body. Oh, never mind. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. You don't need to tell me to press E to interact every time. Okay, I'm leaving, I guess. I'm not leaving! I'm staying put! I'm not going anywhere! Oh, now I'm being chased by something. Oh, this is not okay. Oh, this is not okay. This is not okay. Okay. We can really do without the horror attractions here at this local park. There's no need for this. It's just a playground. Crawl, go! This is my least favorite attraction! Oh! We're still crawling! We're still going! You know, this is why amusement park rides don't last very long. Because at some point, you're not even really afraid. You know, the excitement is gone. Okay, but those sound like they're getting really close. So the excitement, the fear is back. Why am I not crawling fast enough? Come on, we're done now. We're done. We're done. We have to be done. We have to be done. Oh boy! Oh, oh boy! I just want to go home now. <laughs> I just want to go home! Oh... That last part was intense.
that last part was something else. I it was it was okay because at some point, right? At some point, you're like, all right, how long is this supposed to last? You know, it was it felt like the crawling was going on for a little too long. Either something was gonna get me or something was not gonna get me. It was really good though. I liked the uh, I liked that absolutely nothing happened while taking the slide in the woods. A next game! Now our last game here is called Late Night Shift. You work at a convenience store and it's like two in the morning, your coworker calls you to come into the store and you work the night shift. There's nothing else to it. Let's hop in and it is Hey! 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 That's not an iPhone. <laughs> That's not an iPhone. Bro, wake up. It's time for your shift. Okay. <laughs> I'll come in, I promise. Just five more minutes. <sighs> That's legit how I would be if I worked the night shift. I... I could not fathom the idea of coming into work at like midnight and leaving when the sun is damn near coming up so this game apparently has two endings there's a good ending and a bad ending the bad ending is you see that uh heart attack meter down there if that heart attack meter fills up then you get a bad ending that's all i know that that was all i was given so we got to restock our shelves per usual you know what i'm saying this is just everyday things for a, for a grocery store man. Zero missing product. Okay. Okay, I'm not quite sure. Not quite sure what all is really happening. I have a box in my hand. How do I... How do I drop? Eject. Q. What are my controls? Ah! Oh, there's more racks of milk. Okay. I don't know why it wouldn't all be together, but... It's not my grocery store. I've already done my part in, in making grocery stores look nice. I owned a grocery store and I can... Oh, so it's an empty box now. Okay. As I was saying, I've owned a grocery store. I know how it works. I know what the people want. I know how to price things properly. And nobody can tell me that I don't. Because I owned a store. So when do we get into the scary? When does the when does the scary do the scarying? Huh? Ah! <laughs> okay. That's when the scary does the scarying. How do I get my heart attack meter to fill? I want a bad ending. I want to get that bad ending over with. Uh, instant food, instant food, instant food, instant food, instant food, instant food, instant food. Okay. Give me another heart attack! Scare me! Jump scare me! Boo me! D uh, scare me! Rawr! I want it! There's more instant food out here? Scare me! I'm ready for it this time! I want you to get my heart racing! I want you to really make me feel it. I want you to really make me work for my, my pay. Aha. No! Come on! Pussy! Fill up my jump scare meter! Or my heart attack meter, whatever. <laughs> scare me! Make me feel like, oh, I'm gonna die! Oh! That's how I wanna be. That's what, that's what, uh, that's the, that's the feeling that I wanna have. You die from a heart attack. Was that it? Was that the bad ending? Was that my bad end? That was the bad ending? Okay, that was a waste of my time. So how do I get it down? How do I mellow myself up? How do I relax? Bro, wake up. It's time for your shift. My thing about this scene, right? I, I shouldn't be taking this seriously at all. But why does your coworker have to call you to tell you to wake up? Why don't you already have an alarm set? Was this a was this a bonding agreement between the two of you to be like, hey, I need you every night to wake me up for my shift. Before you clock out, you tell me to clock in. What kind of agreement is that? I don't need somebody to tell me when to wake up. I do it on my own terms. If I'm late, oh well. 
Jesus. Off rip for sure. Okay, I think I just stay still to mellow down. Whew, I gotta collect myself, you know? I gotta zen, peace. Oh, give my heart a second to breathe because what the hell was that, you know? You know what, this is actually kind of nice. Oh my god! Uh, uh, they are certainly taking a page out of the don't scream book just throwing random jump scares at you at the most random times <sighs> what i was going to say was this is kind of nice because not only do i give the character some time to relax after that jump scare but it also gives me a chance to relax after the jump scare and as long as i, I feel like the more boxes i fill the more jump scares are going to be thrown at me all right, be prepared, 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 be prepared. We learn from experience that jump scares can get you at any time. Why am I even working here? Is this a product of like a lack of sleep? Or, or is this just because we have a legitimate infestation here at this this store? What is the real problem here? <laughs> it's just sounds. It is just sounds. It's just sounds. I promise you if I were to have taken my headset off during that ju I think, okay, here, next time I'm going to... Take my headphones off. And when I get jump scared, I want to know if it is just the sounds that are scaring me or if it's the actual act of something popping up out of nowhere. I'm going to take the headphones off because a lot of the times video games are just auditory. A lot of the things in video games are literally just auditory. Horror games specifically, you know? Because nothing that jumps out at you is actually scary. It's just the noises that you hear. That's why people scream at you at the the horror attractions people will scream at you instead of just popping up out of nowhere they know that's how they get you see that didn't scare me at all it's all just auditory i've proven my point all right you know what if this game wants to take a page out of don't screams uh uh playbook i'm gonna take a page out of the don't scream playbook as well and i'm gonna try my hardest not to scream when i get jump scared if I can do it in one game, I can do it in this one. I can do it. <laughs> if I take a page out of don't, I have to pretend like my mic is, is tracking my volume. Just like don't scream. If I scream, I die. If I scream, I start over. You know, but where's the fun in that, right? This game is not made specifically to not scream. I'm supposed. What the fuck? I have to turn on flashlight. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You're joking. The breaker box is right here. Can I just turn the power back on? No fucking way. You want me to fill my last three boxes with. I have to check the electricity first. It's right here. I need, it need a tape? What do you mean? It need a what? Where the hell do I find tape? Okay. Don't jump scare me, please. Don't jump scare me, please. Don't jump scare me, please. The source of all electricity in this shop. Don't mess with it. All right, now I have to continue my work. That was so fucking random. What is that? I'm just gonna continue my work. I'm just gonna continue my work. I'm just gonna continue my work. Because holy hell, what the shit, biscuits. I can't run anymore. What, do my legs not work? What, why the hell can I run? Okay, there we go. Ah! You mother There's one more box. There's 
Just one more box. Nothing can harm me with just one more box of work left. I'll be totally fine. I'll be totally fine to finish out my shift and go home and get some rest because clearly I need it. Clearly I'm in dire need of some rest because something like this wouldn't be happening to a completely rested and well sane person. Maybe if I've got schizophrenia, but I, I don't know. Is that what's going on here? <laughs> Who's calling? Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna wait for our Zen peace. I'm not moving until I go grab until I'm till I'm perfectly calm. Fuck. <laughs> oh, am I having a heart attack? What the hell is this? This does not look like a familiar number. Hello? Hello? Ah, Bro, I'm coming, Jay. It's time for my shift. By the way, how was your night? All fine, right? No, I had a heart attack once. I was resuscitated somehow. Resuscitated. And then shit just kept jumping out at me. Okay. <laughs> Late night shift. Girl. Why don't you, uh, the song's fading out. Okay. Um, maybe another time. Maybe some other time. Last night, this was really quiet. There wasn't even one customer. I think people just go back to their hometowns. Okay! So that was Late Night Shift. Those are our three scary games. We played Ritual, A Slide in the Woods, and Late Night Shift. I would say that these are all really decent horror games. They, they gave me spooks. The only criticism that I do have for a slide in the woods was that the chase scene did feel like it went on a little too long. After a certain point, I wasn't even really worried or scared anymore. The only part that almost had me was when the sounds, the crawling sounds from whatever it was behind me were getting closer. But other than that, these were some decent scary games. Great job to all the developers of these games. You guys need to go and support them. You should <laughs> go and support them. Support some of their other projects. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you're new around here, why not subscribe? You know, it's free. Tell your friends, tell your family, tell your dog. If you want to see my last video, which was Remothered Tormented Fathers, I'll have that link somewhere around here. And if you want to see the full playlist of three scary games that I have played, I'll also have that link somewhere around here. I'm gonna get out of here. I love you guys. Stay safe out there. Take it easy. And big buddy out. Now I need to take my ass to the store so I can do some grocery shopping.